What's up, everybody? So, <clears throat> we're here bringing you a whole nother video. And um, today, I want to I'm sorry if I look, I just woke up. Today, I want to talk about, you know, we always talk about boundaries and respect and that. And hold on, I just want to white balance and respect and that. You know, um, I've just realized that, like, you got to have a level of self-respect for yourself and know that no matter what happens, you're not going to let somebody disrespect you. You're not going to let somebody, like, you know, just be mean to you because, you know, you don't deserve that. You don't deserve that. So I just want to say that, first of all, no matter what, I don't care who it is, don't let nobody disrespect you. Don't let nobody disrespect you. Have your boundaries. You know, um, stick up for yourself because if you let one person disrespect you, the whole world will see that and they will disrespect you like that, even including yourself. Because you're going to think that that's the way to be treated. And I'm here to let you know that that's not the way to be treated. It's important that you carry yourself with the utmost respect so you can get that from other people. And you be very clear on what is disrespect and what is not respect because respect is due to a dog. You got to stand firm. You got to protect yourself very fiercely like a mother protecting their child. You have to be like that with yourself. You have to be or else you're going to forever get pushed around. You got to stand up for yourself. You got to be the, the, the power, the royalty that you always are, that you've always been. But you got to finally accept that and choose to be that because it's been waiting for you to choose it. You know what I'm saying? So you got to, you got to for real just, you know, be, be you wholeheartedly, of course, and I think the biggest thing to take away from this is just like literally just don't let nobody push you around because you're not somebody to be pushed around. You're special, especially if you're watching this. You're special. You're different. You're into different things. So people are going to try to push you around or try to or try to make you seem like you weird or different. Like, you know. And just, you know, when you see people's true colors, believe them. You know, love them for who they are, expect them to be who, who they are and understand that a lot of people create trouble or create problems all because of how they were raised and that's all they know. So don't take it personal. Don't think that it's because of you because it's not. It's not. A lot of people deal with personal trauma that they haven't healed and that's not an excuse, but that's just perspective for you. You don't have to continue to deal with these people, but understand that it's not because they hate you. It's not because they dislike you. Maybe some of them do, right? But all of that hate and dislike comes from being in a home environment that wasn't healthy for them at one point. So you got to really just, you know, charge it to the game and just be like, all right, cool. I'm going to use that energy to transmute and go even harder on your craft. Go even harder on your craft. Because that's the point. That's the point. Nothing happens for a reason. Everything is for a reason. Everything is to make you grow. Everything is to make you a better person. Everything is to heal you. Everything is to get you closer to where you need to be. So don't be looking at the universe like, why are you doing this? Why are you doing this to me? Why are you doing this to me? And understand that the universe is doing it for you. The universe is doing it for you. They don't, they, they don't want you to stay stagnant. They don't want you to stay comfortable. They want you to be uncomfortable. They want you to be comfortable being uncomfortable so you can always be able to grow. Because uncomfortability is how you grow. When you're comfortable, you're not growing. You're not growing. So you got to make sure that you take these hits that people want to throw at you. Because this is the test. This is the test. You got to take these hits that people are throwing at you. Take the hits. Take the energy from them. And throw them back out to the world. Add more power to it. Sample it. Throw more power into that punch. And go get you some some accomplishments. Go get you some, some forward movement. Some momentum. Focus on yourself, yo. Like, I think, I think, like, 
obviously like people fail to realize how like you're alone but you're not alone all at the same time so what I mean by is that like you know when it comes to these the this realm of like higher consciousness like y'all need to understand that there's a splitting happening meaning everybody who is high consciousness is going to a different consciousness a different realm and everybody who's not consciousness or not high vibe they're going off into another realm so we're all about to split we're about to split like I find myself not even wanting to hang hang out or be around certain people who I feel are not at a level of thinking that I am or at least not open-minded to it you know because it's like you're gonna end up holding me back because the higher and higher I get in consciousness the more and more stuff that I'm gonna figure out that's gonna sound crazy to you and I don't need nobody around me that's going to sit here and be like, oh, I don't know sticks, I don't know. Like, I don't need no nobody, none of that. I don't need none of that. I don't need none of that. Period. If you're not healed, if you're not high vibe, if you're not clairvoyant, clair- I, I, I just, I just can't. Because it's like, I just, I don't want nobody gaslighting me, making me feel like what I'm saying is not important. Like, I know what I deserve now, especially because of y'all. Y'all done show me a level of love that is like, listen, if y'all not, if you're not loving me like how my supporters loving me, then I can't love you. I can't love you. Because the way my supporters love me and the way I love them is a great relationship. We help each other. We listen to each other. You know what I'm saying? It's not nobody is better than the other. Like, I don't get it. And it's like, it's so crazy because... Like, I feel like people try to make it seem like I think I'm better than others when I am always making it known. You know, it's crazy. I'm always trying to make it known that we are all the same because there's always somebody there acting like I'm thinking that I'm better than everybody. And that's just my North No Leo. People don't realize that my North No Leo is like like forcing me to be in the center of attention. And people don't realize that. At one point in my life, I didn't want to be the center of attention, but I had to accept that. I had to, I had to be like, okay, cool, this is what y'all telling me to do. This is how I can help people, you know? So this is just like, you know, little rant, little ramble, whatever you want to call it. But all I know is that, you know, no matter what happens in my life, every single situation, every single test, I will use it to make me stronger. I will use it to make me more creative, more successful. Um, There is only going to be good that comes out of situations. There's not going to be no bad. No matter what situation happens, I'm always going to use it to my advantage. I'm always going to use it to my advantage. So, you know, charge it to the game and keep it pushing. Charge it to the game and keep it pushing, y'all. I promise you, you will be successful if you believe it. Truly. I don't let nothing stop my confidence. I don't let nothing stop my belief because I know what I know has gotten me this far with over 300,000 followers, which is amazing. And I'm truly grateful for that. Truly grateful for that. Over 300,000 people follow me on TikTok. That's amazing. That's amazing. And I'm here to show my gratitude for that. So, again, thank you for supporting. Thank you. I love you all. Love to Amun Ra, the sun god. I'm grateful to be here, grateful to have you here. I'm grateful you're you're alive, well, and I love you, and I'm out.